Connecticut is the southernmost state in the region of the United States known as New England. Connecticut is also often grouped along with New York and New Jersey as the tri-state area. It is bordered by Rhode Island to the east, Massachusetts to the north, New York to the west, and Long Island Sound to the south. Its capital city is Hartford, and its most populous city is Bridgeport. The state is named after the Connecticut River, a major U.S. river that approximately bisects the state. The word Connecticut is derived from various anglicized speakings of an Algonquin word for long tidal river. Connecticut is the third smallest state by area, the 29th most populous, and the fourth most densely populated of the 50 United States. It is known as the Constitution State, the Nutmeg State, the Provision State, and the Land of Steady Habits. It was influential in the development of the federal government of the United States. Much of southern and western Connecticut is part of the New York metropolitan area. Three of Connecticut's eight counties are statistically included in the New York City Combined Statistical Area, which is widely referred to as the Tri-State Area. Connecticut's center of population is in Cheshire, New Haven County, which is also located within the Tri-State Area. Connecticut's first European settlers were Dutch. They established a small, short-lived settlement in present-day Hartford at the confluence of the Park and Connecticut rivers, called Heis de Goda Hoop. Initially, half of Connecticut was a part of the Dutch colony, New Netherland, which included much of the land between the Connecticut and Delaware rivers. The first major settlements were established in the 1630s by England. Thomas Hooker led a band of followers overland from the Massachusetts Bay Colony and founded what would become the Connecticut Colony. Other settlers from Massachusetts founded the Saybrook Colony and the New Haven Colony. The Connecticut and New Haven colonies established documents of fundamental orders, considered the first constitutions in North America. In 1662, the three colonies were merged under a royal charter, making Connecticut a crown colony. This colony was one of the 13 colonies that revolted against British rule in the American Revolution. The state also has a long history of hosting the financial services industry, including insurance companies in Hartford and hedge funds in Fairfield County. As of the 2010 census, Connecticut features the highest per capita income, human development index, and median household income in the United States. Geography Connecticut is bordered on the south by Long Island Sound, on the west by New York, on the north by Massachusetts, and on the east by Rhode Island. The state capital and third largest city is Hartford, and other major cities and towns include Bridgeport, New Haven, Stamford, Waterbury, Norwalk. Danbury, New Britain, Greenwich and Bristol. Connecticut is slightly larger than the country of Montenegro. There are 169 incorporated towns in Connecticut. The highest peak in Connecticut is Bear Mountain in Salisbury in the northwest corner of the state. The highest point is just east of where Connecticut, Massachusetts, and New York meet, on the southern slope of Mount Frisell, whose peak lies nearby in Massachusetts. The Connecticut River cuts through the center of the state, flowing into Long Island Sound. The most populous metropolitan region centered within the state lies in the Connecticut River Valley. Despite Connecticut's relatively small size, it features wide regional variations in its landscape. For example, in the northwestern Litchfield Hills, it features rolling mountains and horse farms, whereas in the southeastern New London County, it features beaches and maritime activities. Although Connecticut has a long maritime history, and a reputation based on that to history, Connecticut has no direct access to the sea. Although Connecticut has easy access to the Atlantic, between Long Island Sound and Block Island Sound, Connecticut has no direct ocean coast. Connecticut's rural areas and small towns in the northeast and northwest corners of the state contrast sharply with its industrial cities. 
located along the coastal highways from the New York border to New London, then northward up the Connecticut River to Hartford. Many towns center around a green, such as the Litchfield Green, Lebanon Green, and Weathersfield Green. Near the green typically stand historical visual symbols of New England towns, such as a white church, a colonial meeting house a colonial tavern or inner, several colonial houses, and so on. Establishing a scenic historic appearance maintained for both historic preservation and tourism. Connecticut consists of temperate broadleaf and mixed forests. Northeastern coastal forests of oaks, hickories, and maple cover much of the state. In the northwest, these give way to New England Acadian forests of the Taconic Mountains. The northern boundary of the state with Massachusetts is marked by the Southwick Jog or Granby Notch, an approximately 2.5 miles square detour into Connecticut. The actual origin of this anomaly is clearly established in a long line of disputes and temporary agreements which was finally concluded in 1804, when Southern Southwick, whose residents sought to leave Massachusetts, was split in half. The southwestern border of Connecticut, where it abuts New York State, is marked by a panhandle in Fairfield County, containing the towns of Greenwich, Stamford, New Canaan, Darien, and parts of Norwalk and Wilton. This irregularity in the boundary is the result of territorial disputes in the late 17th century culminating with New York giving up its claim to the area, whose residents considered themselves part of Connecticut, in exchange for an equivalent area extending northwards from Ridgefield to the Massachusetts border as well as undisputed claim to Rye, New York. Areas maintained by the National Park Service include Appalachian National Scenic Trail, Quinbar and Shetucket Rivers Valley National Heritage Corridor, and Weir Farm National Historic Site. Climate Much of Connecticut has a humid continental climate, with cold winters and warm humid summers. Far southern and coastal Connecticut has a more mild, humid, temperate, subtropical climate with seasonal extremes tempered by proximity to the Atlantic, ocean, warmer winters, and longer frost-free seasons. Most of Connecticut sees a fairly even precipitation pattern with rainfall, snowfall spread throughout the 12 months. Connecticut averages 56% of possible sunshine, averaging 2,400 hours of sunshine annually. Summer is hot and often humid throughout the state, with average highs in New London of 81 degrees Fahrenheit and 87 degrees Fahrenheit in Windsor Locks. Although summers are sunny in Connecticut, summer thunderstorms often bring quick downpours with thunder and lightning. Winters are generally cool to cold from south to north in Connecticut, with average January temperatures ranging from 38 degrees Fahrenheit in the coastal lowlands to 29 degrees Fahrenheit in the inland and northern portions on the state. The average yearly snowfall ranges from about 50 to 60 inches in the higher elevations of the northern portion of the state to only 20 to 25 inches along the southeast coast of Connecticut. Generally, any locale north or west of Interstate 84 receives the most snow during a storm and throughout the season. Early spring can range from cool to warm, while mid and late spring is warm to hot. Fall months are mild and bring colorful foliage across northern parts of the state in October and November. During hurricane season, tropical cyclones occasionally affect the region. Thunderstorms are most frequent during the summer, occurring on average 30 times annually. These storms can be severe, and the state usually averages one tornado per year. Connecticut's warmest temperature is 106 degrees Fahrenheit, which occurred in Danbury on July 15, 1995. The coldest temperature is minus 32 degrees Fahrenheit, which occurred in Falls Village on February 16, 1943, and Coventry on January 22, 1961.